Here we want to find all six trigonometric ratios defined by the acute angle B of a right triangle where cosine of B is 5 over 13. All right, so let's begin by drawing an illustration. Certainly it's not drawn to scale, but we'll label the angles A, B, and C. Here we'll assume the right triangle um, has a 90 degree angle here at C. Okay, with the ratio given as 5 over 13 for cosine, now remember cosine is defined as the side adjacent over the hypotenuse. So 5 represents the, the length of the adjacent side. So here's angle B, and with that we'll label this as 5 units, right? This is the side adjacent to that angle. And the hypotenuse is given to be 13. So cosine of B equals 5 over 13 corresponds to this illustration. Now to get our six trigonometric ratios, we're going to need the length of the side opposite of angle B. We'll label it here as B. To do that, we'll use the Pythagorean theorem. All right, so B squared plus 5 squared has to equal 13 squared. That's leg squared plus leg squared equals hypotenuse squared. Now doing the math, we have b squared plus 25 equals 169. Subtracting 25, we have b squared equals 144. All right, so b equals plus or minus the square root of 144, which is plus or minus 12 units. Since this is sort of a geometry problem, we'll choose b to be equal to positive 12, right? So this is the length of 12 units right here. Now certainly once we have all three of those sides of the right triangle, we can, we can now write out our six trigonometric ratios. Now we have to be a little careful. It wanted the angle b. Okay, so sine of angle B is defined to be the side opposite, the length of the side opposite divided by the hypotenuse. So the opposite side of B is 12. So that ratio is going to be 12 thirteenths, or 12 over 13. Now cosine of B was given. It was given to be 5 over 13, but you could see here the adjacent side is 5, and the hypotenuse is 13. Tangent of angle B is defined to be opposite over adjacent. So in this case, 12 over 5. Okay, now the other three trigonometric ratios are the reciprocal. So the reciprocal of tangent is called cotangent. So cotangent of B is 5 twelfths. Secant is the reciprocal of cosine, so secant um, in this case is going to be 13 over 5, and cosecant is the reciprocal of sine, so in this case 13 over 12. And there's the six trigonometric ratios for this given problem.